you for volunteering the um, human test subject initiative. Uh, we'll get you right into that just now. Uh, I'm just going to take you through this uh, mental and physical test real quick, just to make sure you don't have the IQ of an ape. Uh, not a corporate sport, it's not mine. Uh, so yeah, just... Alright, alright, well done. Um, you don't have the actually capable of the you know, basic problem solving. Um, uh, this this part of the test is a little bit more uh, complex. It involves something called jumping. If you don't know what jumping is, well, uh, that's a death. All right, looks like you can jump and you can um, pick stuff up on the ground. Find those, get through this last door, and um, yeah, then we can get you into the test proper. Freezing boxes and pressure pads like those ones in front of you. Use that to get through the door. Right, uh, in this chamber, you'll have to use the gun's secondary trigger, or its right trigger, to solve the test. Just, um, go ahead and press that button uh, by that hole over there and uh, dispense out the box. Then hit that box with the right trigger hit it with a beam of force, and uh, use that to beat the test. Oh, and um, there is a dead beam of lasers right now, uh, so try to call it out. Um, yeah, I don't think I need to explain why. Trigger for force. Bam. Finish. 
well <laughs> on making through the majority of the testing course. This will be the final few chambers. Um, that thing down there uh, that just popped up is known as a piston. It uh, extends and retracts. Um, I'm pretty sure you know the drill at this point. Oh, yeah, that's uh, the on the other side over there. Uh, it doesn't activate when you stand on it, unlike other buttons. It's the same. Up by now. Hush, little baby, don't say a word. Mama's gonna buy you a mockingbird. And if that mockingbird won't sing, Mama's gonna buy you a diamond ring.